Hey, this is Joe from Marine Connection, Fort Lauderdale. I'm here with the Blackfin 302, and I just want to show you a couple features as to why this should be your next adventure on the water. So up here at the bow, you got a big, prominent bow flare to keep you nice and dry when you're out there running in the rough water. This boat's built with all hand laid fiberglass. You have a very sharp point of entry to slice through the rough waves. Optimal hull design with two reverse radius lifting strakes on both sides of the hull giving you nice lift and stability when you're cruising in the ocean. This model here has a standard bow thruster helping you swing the bow over in the windy conditions when you're trying to dock or leave the dock. It really helps out there as well. You have a through hull, stainless steel polished, windless anchor. Down the side of the boat, this hull was designed by Michael Peters. So what you have is a double stepped hull design. So the double stepped hull design does a few things for you, okay? So it breaks up the chop nicely. It creates pockets of air under the running surface. So there's less friction, allowing the boat to glide through the water easier and less, less resistance against the bottom of the hull and less energy transferring through the deck and into your body, which is very nice. You got this awesome side dive door here with a heavy duty dive ladder. What's nice about this dive ladder, it's very easy to clip into the bracket, but it's also got its own designated storage spot down inside the head. So it's, you know, you don't have to leave it anywhere where it's rattling around, banging around. It's got its own nice spot with latches that hold it shut. So standard comes with 300 Mercury's on this boat, but this one has the upgraded 350 Mercury Verados. Okay, so there's plenty of power on this bad boy. It's a 55 mile an hour boat. You got the custom white painted engines and with the Mercury Verado, you get the advanced midsection. What the advanced midsection does is it creates a very smooth, quiet and a vibration free ride. So you don't feel any vibration from the motors throughout the boat. It disperses all the vibration and energy down throughout the shafts. So you don't feel that uh, vibration reverberating throughout the hull of the boat. Makes it a very smooth and quiet experience on the water. You've got underwater LED lights. So when you're pulling up to the, the dock and dines, you turn those on. Get some nice colors coming out from underneath the water out of the back of the boat. And you've got big heavy duty Lenko trim tabs so you can always even out the ride quality, help the boat get on plane with a heavy load or in rough conditions, um, and just to manipulate the boat so it's always riding nice and even and flat the way you want it to ride. So you have the dive, uh, dive ladder on the other side of the boat, but you also have a regular swim platform ladder. They do a nice job putting the ladder away from the motors. It comes off the side of the boat, so it's not near the propellers, which is a nice safety feature that families really like. Um, you also have a covered deck lid. So when you do enter onto the swim platform here, you have a flat surface with no tripping hazards as well. So they do a very good job of that. So as you can see, there's just so much room that Blackfin gives you between the motors and this back transom wall, giving you a nice workable platform back here. So when it's time to flush your engines out at the end of the day, you can comfortably reach the flush connectors. Um, and you can use this swim platform at, you know, as a, at the sandbar with your family when you're jumping in the water, swimming around, playing on your toys, which is really nice. They give you a nice wide walkthrough here, so it's nice and easy to get into the cockpit of the boat. Um, tons of room back here for fishing. But when you're not fishing and you're ready to entertain and go out to the sandbar and have a good time, you have an awesome fold out transom seat here. What's really nice about the seat is how thick and heavy duty the hardware is. And that's for every piece of hardware on this boat. They give you nice, thick stainless steel seat frames, backing plates, hinges, and hardware. Uh, the back seat is tall and broad. So when you sit in it, it comes all the way out to your knees and the backrest comes up nice and high all the way to your back. You have a 30 gallon insulated live well with a one inch thick lid. Everything is very thick and heavy duty on these boats. They give you the blue color on the inside to control temperature. We have a fully gel coat finished bilge compartment with these awesome hinges. You just click a button and pull up. There's no folding and twisting, which a lot of our competitors have. You have gel coat finish on the bottom side of all the deck lids. You have two stainless steel heavy duty list lifting pistons as well as a nice thick rubber gasket to seal this shut. And everything in this bilge compartment is fully finished. Every uh, fuel line and drain line is all double stainless steel hose clamps for a little extra integrity. And what's nice is you can close these hinges with your feet. You just step on them and close them. You don't have to bend down, twist and fold um, just to close all your, uh, your hatches. You have two in the floor fish boxes that are 54 gallons each. Again, those are macerator pumped standard. 
And again, what's nice is everything is fully finished everywhere. We give you two lifting pistons and you can close everything with your feet, making it a little easier on your back and your body when you're out there. We have C-deck inserts along our gunnel walls, which protect the fiberglass from chafing from rods and reels scratching around. You've got a nice optional aft shade on this one. Beautiful prep station right here for places to hang your rigs. You have a knife slot and a plier slot. Every material they use down to their shower heads, you have a stainless steel shower head and a stainless steel hose. No rubber, no plastic, no cheap parts. You also have this beautiful Yeti cooler that's on a convenient sliding tray, so it's easily accessible when you need it, but it tucks away, so it's nice and out of the way when you're not using the cooler. We're now gonna walk up to the helm area here, which Blackfin doesn't even like to call it a helm because it doesn't do it any justice. They call it a command center. So what you have is two beautiful, nice Garmin touchscreens, full color, full GPS. You have a through-hull transducer. You have all your switching conveniently located. What's nice on the Blackfin is they don't short you on the stereos. They give you a Fusion Apollo head unit, JL audio stereo system, and it's the, it's the upgraded JL speakers with the blue LED lights. You also have subwoofers for bass, so the stereo system is just awesome on this boat. You have a tilting steering wheel here. You have their standard bow thruster controller. This one we equipped with a Mercury joystick with all the features like autopilot and skyhook digital anchoring. We have beautiful style and design to our upholstery. We have all diamond stitch patterns, two-tone interior colors. You know, again, I, I have to point out the hardware because you just, you, you can't stress it enough. All of our armrests have full length, thick stainless steel backing plates on them as well. One of my favorite features is the raised helm platform. Again, this is a big, heavy offshore fishing boat that sits very high out of the water. So in the rough, in the rough water in the ocean, you're gonna wanna use this platform to get that visibility over the bow. I can't stress enough how, how great the visibility is when you're standing on this raised helm platform and look at the hardware they use to mount this to the boat. Everything is just overbuilt and heavy duty. So when you're driving this thing, it's a very comfortable helm station. You feel confident because you have all the visibility to see all around the boat. Our hard tops are out of control. So you have a nice uh, forward uh, hard top storage box here. You have cargo net storage forward and aft, which is really nice. People like to put life jackets and whatnot in here. Your powder coated rails, they give you a forward and a rear support bracket. You have JL Audio speakers, overhead lights, spreader lights, um, carbon fiber outriggers. There's a lot going on with our hardtops and the best part about it is how massive and heavy duty the hardtop is. Our, our hardtops are very thick, uh, full, full fiberglass hardtops. Um, so they don't shake, they don't rattle in the wind. They're just a stout, stout hardtop. So now we're gonna walk towards the bow of the boat. There's some awesome features I'd like to show you up here. As you walk up, I can't not point out how nice our combing pads are around the boat. You have nice, thick, tall, and broad combing pads. So anywhere you're walking, if a, wa a rogue wave comes by and rocks the boat, you're constantly hitting a nice foam pad instead of any hard fiberglass that would be uncomfortable. You have a beautiful forward-facing seat here in front of the uh, console with armrests on both sides, nice, thick cushions with that good upholstery that we use, a beautiful cooler underneath the seat and again look how nice these hinges are that they fabricate um, very heavy duty hinges and we have the best backrests for the forward bow seating in the industry what's nice is they slide out of your gunnel walls right here they give you a full stainless steel backing plate these things are heavy they're massive and when you slide them into your bow seats they slide in nice and tight and strong and it provides you a beautiful broad and tall backrest for your forward facing seats. You have gel coat finished storage compartments on both sides of the bow. You have an in the floor fully finished storage compartment that's massive as well. You can put stuff down there. This nice thick table also drops down and we provide you with a cushion so you can make this one big sun lounging area. Um, the bow is super deep. You can see how much freeboard you have up here. So when you're sitting up here, you're surrounded by the boat. You feel like you're in the boat and not on the boat. It's a nice, comfortable feeling, especially in the rough water. Up here at the front of the boat, you have your anchor locker. We provide you with a through hull, stainless steel polished windlass anchor, a very clean anchor locker. Everything's fully uh, gel coat finished fiberglass and you have a uh, freshwater wash down inside the anchor locker as well. So it's if, convenient to clean that out nice and easily right there. You have all stainless steel 
pop-up, pop-down cleats on the boat. Our bow shade is in, providing shade for the entire bow of the boat, which is really nice in the Florida sun. Takes that heat off you, takes the sun off you. Uh, an awesome feature that nobody else incorporates on their boat is the patent pending panographic head door. So our head door closes and opens nice and firm and easy. It doesn't cut off your walkway bow to stern. What I like about it is how it locks shut. You have these heavy duty locking mechanisms and it provides a rattle free, vibration free head door, which a lot of companies give you you know, a little bit to be desired with their thin head doors that rattle and shake and make noise when you're out there in the rough. So when you open this head door up, there is a massive entryway to get down into the head. You don't have to squeeze through a tiny little hole to use the bathroom on this boat. A bigger, a bigger guy like me can get in and out very easily, seamlessly, and everything again is ergonomically well designed. So you have a nice grab handle right here. You can step down into the head comfortably and once you're down here, you have over six foot three inches of head space. I'm 5'11 and I can bounce on my tippy toes down here without hitting my head, which is comfortable when you're down here. You don't have to crouch. You don't have to bend your back and get uncomfortable. There is a shower head down here. You have a porcelain vacuum flush, electric flushing toilet. You have tons of storage down here as well. You have designated storage for your bow table and for your dive ladder down here. Um, so they just do a great job with their head compartments, making it usable and functional for your family. Just, you know, it's, it's a head that you don't want to not use because it's uncomfortable. It's very uh, easy to get in and out. So, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a very practical usage of the space. And again, it's very easy to step out of the head without hitting your head, without crouching your body, without contorting yourself just to get in and out of the compartment. So, listen, this boat has so many features packed into it. It's an amazing fishing boat, but it's also a comfortable, entertaining boat. You could do anything on this boat you want. We have them in stock and available here at the Fort Lauderdale Marine Connection location. So I hope to see you guys by here and call us up with any questions. One of our professional sales members will uh, walk you through the process if you're interested in getting out on the water. Uh, Joe from Marine Connection, Fort Lauderdale signing off. Thanks for your time.